Oh, come on. How are we supposed to make a jump like that? Hello, guys, and well, yeah, quick save, of course. <laughs> Hello, guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Half Life with Miox Fu, and. <gasps> hey, we made it. <laughs> oh, come on. Quick save again. That one was easy. It was even easier because it was short. Ew. Ew, no wonder the, there's green runoff down there. That's all coming from the worm. Alright, so we took care of you, mister. Oh yes, if you destroy this one, if you don't like to jump across, you can take this little thing right here, the little power conduit. Same with the other thing. If you break that bridge, you can take the oxygen fuel lines across. So it doesn't make it that much more difficult. It makes it a little more difficult if you break them, but not that much more. Um, just hold on a second, guys. Sorry, you got to see Gordon Freeman check out his gun while I took a sip of my soda. Now, as you can see, these dials mean absolutely nothing because we can't see the words. <laughs> But I'm sure they'll be swinging around or something when we get this system all booted up. After we get past... Yeah, same with these ones, probably. Oh, God. Hello there, all of you... Guys. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Idea time. Let's see if we can get up past all of these. And... Shotgun you in the butt! <laughs> Take care of the barnacles now, because I don't want to run into them later. This is going pretty swimmingly. Pretty swimmingly indeed. Anywho, what do we have down here? I have an idea that as soon as we hit this, something bad's going to happen, so quick save it is. Oh god, power's coming on. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? Oh. Oh. It's just an elevator. Huh. Okay, maybe I was wrong, guys. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe nothing bad is actually gonna happen. It's just an elevator, after all. I thought it was the power coming on, and then something terrible was gonna happen, because doesn't that always happen? Oh my god, we're going down. Why are we going down? Why are we going down? I thought this was gonna go up. Oh god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god! I should have listened to myself. Of course something bad happens whenever the power comes on. Oh. Get out of there! Come on, stabilize me, Mr. Mr. HEV suit. I hope no one expects me to start up the generator. Smithers went down there and never came back. <laughs> Smithers went down there. I get it. Is that a is that a Simpsons joke because of all the radioactive waste around? What? What, are you a Mr. Burns and won't come with me? Screw you. <laughs> You're not gonna risk life and limb with me, then you deserve to die. You're just gonna let your own co-worker, your Mr. Smithers, just go alone. And just... Whoa, something's, something's spitting at me. Are you down there? Yes, you are. Let's take care of you first. But anyway, if you're if you're gonna be horrible to the other scientists, I'll be just as horrible to you. All right, let's see. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Please stay here. Please tell me you'll stay here. Oh, okay. That doesn't seem that bad. We just gotta make sure not to get hit by it. Right, just wait half a second for it to go back. There we go. Go up. This is not that bad at all. Oh my god, Smithers, you're alive! Smithers, talk to me! This is my hiding spot, and I'm not moving until the situation is drastically improved. Now go away, and don't tell anyone I'm here! But, but, if we don't tell anybody you're here, how will you... How will we rescue you? Anyway, I'm gonna start this. Hope you don't mind. You should be fine. It won't 
ruin your hiding place at all, right? I don't think it will. Anyway, just make sure to avoid that, like I said, because it will knock you off into all that radioactive goo and it's an instant death. Quick save, so I don't die from an instant death. And I hope this doesn't hurt you, Smithers. Is that it? Oh god, oh god. Oh, come on. I'm like, I, I was wondering why nothing was happening, because I thought it did actually hurt him when... Ah! Shoot. Forgot where we were for a second. I thought it, it did actually hurt him when I turned it on, but nothing was happening. So I'm like, oh, maybe, maybe he's okay. But let's see what happens now. Now that this thing flips down and these electrical probes go over. Oh, uh -huh. I told you. I'm sorry, Mr. Smithers. I told you. I told you you shouldn't have stayed there, but you didn't listen. You didn't listen. <laughs> um, careful now. Careful now. Hey. Okay, good. Now we can just. Whoa, 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 whoa! whoa. What are you doing? What are you doing? Now we can just go back around. Nice and easy. Oh, good. Perfect. Fine. Fine. Yeah, well, you're in HEV suit, so you should be able to take care of those hazardous radiation levels, you know? Right, and I guess we just have to climb back to the top. That's cool. That's cool. A little physical exertion never hurt anybody. Right? Right? Of course it hurt people. <laughs> Of course physical exertion has hurt, hurt people before. Why? Why? Why can I not get off this ladder the right way? No. No. No, stop it. There we go. Jeez. That was ridiculous. Okay. Ow. Ow. Yeah, no, I, I noticed. Thank you, Ichi V-Suit. But I noticed that I really got hurt right there. Oh, thank you. Morphine. That's the, the that's the f exactly what I needed. Cuz that's not going to give me an addiction at all. Oh god. Why? You're sparking on water. Don't you just need to make this more deadly for me, don't you? Well, let's make it through. Oh. Okay, minimal damage, I guess. Oh good. All the dials are freaking out. That must mean it's work. That must mean it's working. Right? Right. Okay. Okay. Hey. Okay, and we'll salt the land behind us. Bye, bridge. <laughs> oh. Oh, I can hear you, Mr. Worm. They call me Dr. Worm. Good morning, how are you? I'm Dr. Worm. You're gonna be dead soon, Dr. Worm. I don't care if you're not a real doctor. I mean, I don't care if you're not a real worm. You are... No, you are a real worm. I don't... But I'm a real doctor. He's a doctor. Not an escalator. He's a doctor. Not a brick layer. Oh, God. He's a doctor. Not a... Oh my god, don't don't hit me. Don't hit me. You you had nothing. Oh my goodness. Quick save. As long as he doesn't hear where I actually am am <laughs> where I actually am, I am fine. Oh my goodness. I am freaking out right now. You guys have no idea how heart-wrenchingly anxious I am right now. You didn't even help me, you jerk. I don't care. You deserve to die for that. You let me go in there and risk my life and limb for what? So I could kill him and save you? I don't think so. You pull your... Po you are a part of a team and you pull your own weight, mister. Quick save. Ooh, actually, I'm making a full new save for this, because this 
This is the coolest thing in this game, I think. All right. Power is full. Turbines to speed. Oxygen. Fuel. Ready? Ready to kick some alien butt? Make it so. Oh, yeah. There we go. Come on. Vroom! <laughs> vroom, vroom! <laughs> oh. I don't care if that is sadistic or schadenfreude or anything like that. It is so good to see that thing finally dead. Oh. That is a nightmare that is now gone. Just wait for it to cool, I guess. Just gonna keep cooling? Okay. Whoa! Alarm. What's the alarm for? Get at my gun, because I, I am I am worried now. I got my gun, I'm safe. I guess that means it's just cooling or something. I don't know. Anyway, let's go back around and check how that damage is gone. Actually, I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Half-Life with Neox Fu. And there appears to be a hole at the bottom. And we will check out where that hole will lead. Because that's where we're going next. Uh, here in Half-Life with Neox Fu. So, take it easy.